Mark Reed Levine was born on the 21st of September 1957 in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania in the United States of Jewish descent and is a lawyer, radio show host and author, most likely known for his radio program called The Mark Levine Show. He is also known for several books he's written, mostly pertaining to government, politics, and related matters, having worked for the administration of President Ronald Reagan. He's still a contributor to various publications. So, just how rich is Mark Levine? As of late 2017, Celebrity.Money informs us of a net worth that is over $7 million accumulated through the various elements of his career. His continued work means his wealth will likely continue to rise. Mark is the son of Jack E. Levine, who also authored several books. He matriculated from Cheltenham High School in just three years and then went to Temple University, graduating with a degree in political science. By 1977, as summa cum laude, he was just 19 years old at the time. He became a part of the school board in the same year and by 1980 earned a Juris Doctorate, or JD, from the Temple University Beasley School of Law. After law school, Levine worked for Texas Instruments and then in 1981 became a part of the Ronald Reagan administration. During his time there, he worked as an advisor and then became the associate director of presidential personnel. Later on, he would become the chief of staff to Attorney General Edwin Meese. Aside from these roles, Mark became the Deputy Assistant Secretary for Elementary and Secondary Education and also a Deputy Solicitor for the U.S. Department of the Interior. For his private sector work, he continued to practice law and became the President of the Landmark Legal Foundation, which focused on public interest. Clearly, his net worth was rising steadily. Mark started his career in radio mainly as a contributor to conservative radio talk shows. Eventually, his popularity earned him spots on the Rush Limbaugh show and later the Sean Hannity show. He built a friendship with Hannity, and they became collaborators to each other's shows, when in 2006, Mark started his own, The Mark Levine Show. He's considered one of the most listened to commentators among all national talk show programs, although his sometimes controversial views are invariably associated with the far right of U.S. politics. He supported Ted Cruz during the 2016 presidential election, then somewhat reluctantly Donald Trump. He continues to contribute to various media outlets. In his written work, he has released five books. In 2005, the first was entitled Men in Black, How the Supreme Court is Destroying America. Then two years later, he published Rescuing Sprite, a dog lover's story of joy and anguish, a nonfiction account of his encounter with Sprite, a dog he rescued from the local animal shelter. His third book was Liberty and Tyranny, a conservative manifesto in 2009, which became a New York Times number one bestseller, and it also reached number two on the Amazon.com bestselling book list that year. In 2012, Ameritopia, the unmanking of America, was published, and in the following year, he released The Liberty Amendments, Restoring the American Republic, which actually debuted at number one on the New York Times bestseller list. His latest book, released in 2015, is entitled Plunder and Deceit, Big Government's Exploitation of Young People in the Future, which also became number one on the New York Times nonfiction bestseller list. For his personal life, Mark Levine is married to Kendall, and they have two daughters. Unconfirmed reports suggest that the couple may divorce. It is known that Mark spends some of his time participating in charity work such as the Freedom Concerts. He was rewarded with the American Conservative Union Award during 2001. <laughs>